आप सभी को गुरु रविदास जी जन्मदिन की ढेर सारी शुभकामनाएं मेरा नाम संजय भगत है और मैं बॉस्टन स्टडी ग्रुप नाम के ऑर्गेनाइजेशन से संबंधित हूँ अम्बेडकर बॉस्टन स्टडी ग्रुप जो है वो अम्बेडकर आइट ऑर्गेनाइजेशन है जो न्यू इंग्लैंड एरिया में सोशल जस्टिस डिस्क्रिमिनेशन पे काम करती है हमारे यहाँ उपस्थित बहुत सारे रविदासी ग्रुप के जो लोग हैं वो बॉस्टन स्टडी ग्रुप से संबंधित है Considering the younger generation in the audience, uh, I would like to speak in English. I am sorry for that. There are 41 verses of Shab or the Shabbats of Guru Ravidas Ji in Holy Guru Granth Sahib. Most of these verses are recited here. Some of these verses may project Guru Ravidas Ji as just a bhagat who consider himself a slave of the God. However, today I am starting. I stand before you to shed light on the profound teachings and the timeless wisdom of Guru Ravidas Ji, a towering figure in Indian history whose message of social equality, fraternity and compassion continues to resonate through the ages. Born in the 15th century near Varanasi, Guru Ravidas Ji was not just a saint or a poet, he was a beacon of hope, a voice for the marginalized and a champion of human dignity. At a time when society was entrenched in the rigid caste system, which he described, Jati Jati Me Jati Hai, Jo Ketan Ke Paaf, Raidaas Manushana Jhul Sake, Jab Tad Jati Me Jati. Just as if the stem of the banana is filled, a leaf appears below the leaf, then a leaf below the leaf, and finally nothing emerges, but the entirety is destroyed. In the same way, humans have also been divided into the caste, and subcaste, people cannot connect with each other till the caste system is annihilated. Guru Ravidas Ji challenged the status quo and advocated for the upliftment of the oppressed. He believed in a world where every individual, regardless of their caste, creed, or social standings, was treated with respect and dignity. His teaching emphasized the fundamental unity of humanity and the importance of breaking down the barriers that divide us. He warned us about the caste discrimination. Jat paat ke phir mahi, urizi rahi sab lo. Manushta ku khat hai, raitaj ka jat kar ho. People are embroiled in the caste and subcaste because of ignorance and the fast preaching. If this continues, this casteism will kill humanity. What profound words which are true today. We are experiencing the migration of Hindu outside India spreading the caste system to other parts of the world. One of the central themes in Guru Ravidaji's philosophy is the rejection of caste discrimination. We all know that the unequal caste system is very unnatural. How can a sensible person believe that the Brahmins born from the Brahma's mouth, Kshatriyas from the arms, Vaishyas from the thighs, and the Shudras from the feet? In so-called untouchables, they are not considered as human beings. Hence, Guru Kabir says, एक ही हार चांद मलमुता एक रुदिर एक गुदा एक बुंद से सब सृष्टि बनी कौन प्राणमन कौन सुदा इट इज ऑल वन स्किन एंड बोन वन पीस एंड शेप वन ब्लड वन मीन फ्रॉम द सेम वन ड्रॉप द यूनिवर्स इज फॉर्म देन हु इज प्राणमन एंड हु इज शुद्र ही वेमेंटली अपोज द नोशन दैट वंस वर्थ इज डिटरमाइंड बाय द बर्थ asserting instead that the true greatness lies in one's actions and the character. In one of his verse, he powerfully declares, Ravidas janma ke kaala nai, bhokta na koi nich, nar ku nich kari daari hai, urche karan ki keech. He gave us a strong message to people who practice cross discrimination. Hama asana khani, hama baithana sukha paaya, sarab jiya dharma, hama jahaj utariya. We have found comfort in sitting, and eating together, dispelling the illusion of caste and class. All Gurudwaras practices Guru Ravidas Ji teaching through the Langa and in this great Gurudwara. We all are experiencing how religious fanatism is destroying the basic fabric of Indian culture and society. A visionary and revolutionary, Guru Ravidas Ji said 500 years back, Nai Nai Pujo Muhammad, Nai Aliha, Nai Ram, Pujo Har Kirtan Sat Sangat, Sat Sangat Jin Vishra. I do not worship Muhammad. 
I nor do worship Allah, I not worship God. I bow to the one who is praised by the whole world. I bow to the true Guru, the true Guru who has given me peace. Guru Ravidaji was against any superstition. So if you hear any stories implemented by Brahmic intellectuals, please ignore. Jaha andha vishwas hai sat parak tahani. Raidas saab soi janas hai anubhav koi manwaan. When there is a blind faith, the truth is hidden. Ravidas says you should accept something based on your experience and not because someone telling you since the ages. To have wisdom, to differentiate between Shraddha and Andha Shraddha, that is your beliefs and the superstition. Guru Ravidachi says, Satya Vidya ko, vidya ko padhe, Sada Prapta Karo Ganyan, Raidas Kahe Bin Vidya, Narki Jan Anya. Always study and attain Jnana, that is knowledge. Raidas say that without the knowledge, the man's life is unknown. Furthermore, Guru Ravidachi spoke passionately about social equality and the importance of treating every human being as an equal. He believed that society could only progress when the inherent dignity of every individual was recognized and respected. I would like to quote a verse from Guru Nanak Ji. Ek andhera tavna tamasi, ek agyan tavni shi, ek agyan sabzo ujiyara, ek agyan sabzo sakalati. It highlights the universality of knowledge and enlightenment. He asserts that the ignorance and darkness are not limited by caste or the social status. Likewise, knowledge and enlightenment are accessible to all, regardless of their background. In addition to advocating for social equality, Guru Ravidaji's teachings are imbued with a profound sense of fraternity and compassion. He preaches love and empathy towards all living beings, transcending boundaries of caste, religion, or creed. His verses resonate with a deep sense of compassion, reminding us of our interconnectedness and shared humanity. As we reflect on Guru Ravidaji teaching, let us spark to build a more inclusive and compassionate society. Let us strive to emulate his message of social equality, fraternity, and compassion in our thoughts, words, and the action. In doing so, we honor not just his legacy, but also uphold the timeless values that continue to guide humanity towards a brighter and more equitable future. We have heard the beautiful rendition of Begum Pura Shahar Kunao Pai Ragi Jatta. Let me leave you with these words of the Guru Navidaji. Begum Pura, a city without any sorrow. Begum Pura is the name of the city where there is no sufferings, no fear, no taxes or customs, no fear, or theft or the fire. Now I have found my own home where peace forever reigns. My brother, stable and eternal is the kingdom. No ethnicity, no enmity, all are as one. Ever prosperous and renowned, there dwell contented souls. Wandering wherever there they be, their abode is not limited to a palace. Says Ravidas, the author, I have found my salvation in that city where I have found my friends. Thank you and Satsiyakar.